Adjusting the brine temperature and the snowball test. It took a couple of weeks of using real ice before Chris found the best brine temperature settings for his ring. He raised the brine temperature in small 1 degree Fahrenheit increments, but at first the ice was brittle and created too much snow. So he tried the snowball test. When trying to form a proper snowball from dry shavings, it fell apart right away. He raised the brine temperature another degree and waited a few days to see how the ice reacted. Could he form a better snowball this time? He tried, but the water was still freezing too fast and his snowball fell apart once again. Chris raised his settings higher yet and found the water was freezing as it should, with no overlapping ridges forming between the lanes, a big indicator of the ice being too cold. Now he is able to form a perfect snowball. If you need any support in making fantastic ice with real ice, please call or email us. In Canada, 1-888-542-9292. Support at realice.ca. In the U.S., 1-844-464-8408. Support at realice.us.